Hey everybody! Today we're going to show you what your children can see on Education City and the features they can access. We'll start with logging in. To log in, you'll need your child's username and password. You can get this from their teacher. Enter the username into this field and then the password underneath. Don't forget that the password is case sensitive. Now use the drop down to select the right country, then simply press log in. Please note that your school may encourage your child to log in with Google and Microsoft Office 365 buttons. Your child can get more information on this from their class teacher. When you've logged in, you'll see your child's homepage. From here, you can access learning resources on Education City. You can search for resources via the search feature at the top. Simply type in a keyword and search results will appear. Or, you can click on a subject button on the homepage. Select a year group and then select one of their content types such as activities and play it. You'll also be able to see any My Cities your child's teacher has set via the Classwork or Homework tabs and My Revision, which is an area where your child can access activities and learn screens that have been selected for them based on their test scores to help them improve on any areas of weakness. Lastly, you'll see My Success, which is where your child can see all the scores from the activities and tests they played. It's great for encouraging them to achieve higher scores. For more information on these features, please see our student view video. Just a note about the icon on the top. This icon will appear as a desktop or tablet icon, depending on what device you're using to access Education City. The tablet friendly icon seen throughout the resource will indicate which pieces of content will be accessible on your tablet device. As a final handy note, don't forget to log out each time you use Education City. You can do this easily via the logout button at the top.